Another thing that I would like to talk about is the SC4 from Nightcore. This is something special. This is a charger, but it's capable of many things that other charger can do. So this is the interesting part. The most interesting from my side is that it can check the battery by checking the internal resistance and by the internal resistance it can save what is the uh, uh, situation of the battery if it is good bad or whatever uh, it can i don't know all the details but we will go over it so it can charge any lithium battery imr lithium lifpo4 which is lower voltage than the leon and the imr also nickel metal nickel cadmium aa aaa AAAA 4A <laughs> which is the first time I am seeing such a thing I am not sure what is AAAA probably it is uh, thicker than the AAA C and D batteries so let's open the box and see what we have inside this is a very very interesting charger so by the way the price of these things is very affordable it's not something expensive it's a few uh, let's say it's under 50 bucks this version okay so let's see here all the details again night core manual and warranty and let's connect power and see what we have by the way, you can also connect, I will zoom in, in order to show better what we see uh, in the LCD, which uh, by the way is a color LCD, maybe it is just two colors, but we have color here. Okay, so what is very interesting about this one, it can do a very fast charge, 3 amp of charge and also as I said it can say what is the situation of the battery so let's put one battery and see what we get so as you can see immediately it is right in Leon lithium ion 4.2 it is constant current now and it is in a good situation and the impedance is 54 milliohms, which is a very good uh, resistance or, or impedance, so uh, it is in a good status. And now we can see that it will also uh, soon, of course, calculate the current that it is inserting into the battery, and now it is charging at a, a little less than 2. A thousand uh, milliamps and it's go over and over uh, on the menu so let's try and check uh, other batteries uh, by the way I have here a battery that is not lithium it's uh, lithium but uh, LIFPO Arba uh, PO4 sorry so I suspect that if the battery is other than a lithium so you have to tell the charger that you are planning to use let's see if pressing now it's detected as a lithium so this is what is called RTFM or read the fucking manual okay so I will now look how to change the mode for L uh, L I I F E P O four. So how do we do it? I will check it in the manual, and in a minute I will tell you how to do it. Okay, found how to do it uh, during uh, entering the battery that is different than lithium <clears throat> just press the C in order to move between 
uh, the abilities and with the V button you change from lithium to L L I F P O four. Maybe I will try to zoom a little so it will be better to see it. Okay, so as you can see it is now blinking and with the V button I change which type of battery it is and by pressing again the C I save it and I can also change the charging uh, current again by using the V button I can change the current that it will charge this is a very nice feature by the way and again I will select it as L I F P O 4 and then long press and it is starting uh, to do the charge okay so uh, let's see if I can put L I F P O 4 with regular lithium nearby and yes I can do that as you can see it detected the other battery as lithium and moving between the batteries it is also good uh, how do I know which battery it is ah, okay I have here a number I will try again to move so that you will be able to see it so the number here is saying 2 it's maybe a little difficult to see so this is battery number 2 LIFPO4 and uh, the channel status and let's see uh, the resistance is 89 milliohms and then I move into battery number 3 by the way if you able to see the, there is a nice line that shows on which battery I'm looking at the line is changing if I'm changing uh, the position of the battery so now the other battery resistance is 61 milliohms and this is a very nice charger it can charge up to 3 amps if it is one battery also another very nice feature also on other night core charger is that you have a 12 volt input that you can plug from your car and also here you have a USB out so if you have another phone that you want to charge during charging the batteries you can connect a cable and charge your phone let's move to a third battery which is another company just to see the status so the fourth battery again uh, is a lithium ion and 61 milliohm which is a good condition uh, now I will try to find another battery let's see if I have another battery to test okay so maybe I will put with all the batteries an Eneloop AA which is a <laughs> different voltage of course and it will detect it and you can see immediately detected as nickel metal hybrid hydrid or nickel cadmium very immediate uh, recognition this is a very very nice charger I recommend I will put a link uh, to Nightcore where to buy it from eBay or Amazon or what is your favorite site uh, to do it I have one more battery that the resistance should be lower than the other I will try to find it and then uh, we will see what we get with the other battery in a second so here I got found the battery that is LG which should be very low resistance so let's check it because this battery can give a very high drain out it is now almost fully charged and let's see the internal resistance in the internal resistance of this one 
is 49 milliohms. Uh, I have to admit not much difference than the other, but this battery should be uh, should be something else. Okay, so that's all for now. Hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe and uh, if you want uh, also to support the channel, if you buy through the link, it's help for the channel. Thank you and bye bye.